Hello YouTubers, this is the B-Man610, and this is what I got from the leather store. So, um, yeah, you guys are probably really sick and tired of these videos, because I've made, you know, maybe 10 or 15 of them. But whatever, um, every time I go, I tell you guys what I'm going to get beforehand in a weekly update. And then, um, so I tell you I'm not going to make a video. And then I go there and end up getting different than what I told you guys. Well, this time I actually didn't get it different than what I told you guys, but... You know, it was changed up a little. So, um, so I had to make a video. So, first off, um, I tried filming this last night. I wanted to change it up so I could tell you how many, you know, pieces I fit into the cups. But I would like to thank the Lego Store employees there so much. There's these two guys, they're really nice. I went up to them, asked them for, you know, one of these cases, but for six by six plates. I went back and got it, and he opened it up for me. And there's literally like that much air at the top, like where there's no bricks. He's like, you probably fit these all into cups. And I'm like, yeah, sure, why not? Let's try it. So, I managed to get, because they helped me out, you know, and stuff. I managed to fit 376 6x6 six six plates into these four cups right here. I had one empty out just so I could count it. Because they're pretty much set up the exact same way. So I just counted how many were in this one, which was 94, and I multiplied it before. You guys can sit in there. That's kind of cool. So it was 94 in here, and then I multiplied it before, and then I got 376. Oh, I got it on my phone. Oh, I have some new text. Yay. Um, ah, right, calculator. Alright. So, no. Oh. 94 times 4 equals 376. You guys see that? 376. So, yeah. So, um, that is insane, guys. I mean, there, I figured out there's about 200 in one of these. 200. That's about how many are in a case. So, I pretty much emptied two cases and only paid $60. But I did get a small cup. It's right over here. I'm going to tell you guys that about that later. So, I ended up paying $72. And it, it's insane, guys. So, now I don't have to get any more 6x6 six six plates. So, I already had 60. So, I have over 400 6x6 six six plates now. But now, I will show you guys. Uh, I'll open one of the cups, actually. And I'll show you guys what was in it. So, first I'll tell you what was in here. Um, I got maroon bricks. So, I got about 50 more maroon bricks. They're already in my base. You guys look over there. Oh, there's my snapple. But, um... Yeah, I already finished putting those on the base. So, um, move this over. Uh, so I got about 50 of those. Then, uh, move my snapple over. I got about 20, maybe more, of these, uh, 1x2 Palisade bricks. Oh, uh, these are really nice. Because last time I got 1x4s, I figured, you know, 1x2s would be nice. Then I got about 10 of these white arches as featured in Lego Boy's Alexander Mock. Uh, I know how to do that technique, guys, so if you want me to make a video, I'll show you. It would, um, the way I, the video I would show you, it would be white one of these, black, 1x2s, and then red for the front, so whatever. And then on the bottom brick, I got about 20 or 30 of these things. Honestly, I honestly have no idea what they are, but. Dang it, that won't work. But, uh, yeah, they sh I'm sure they can be used for something. So that's the small cup I got. I'll move that over here. And then, uh, last night I destroyed one of the large cups. If I move the head, you guys can see those are all the plates I got in the large cup. 94 right there. Plus 30 that are in here. So that's cool. And then I got a ton of these and whatnot as filler bricks. Well, time to actually open a cup. So, we'll see. I'll lower it. There we go. Alright, so, if you guys look, you actually see the lid is not touching the cup. So, we had to literally use, like, you know, the industrial packing tape to close that off. So, that was really nice, because, you know, normally, uh, at any other, like, every other Lego store besides mine that I've been to, if my lid isn't fully secured, they'll make me take bricks out so I can secure it. And then they'll tape it up, which is pointless because it's fully secured, it doesn't need tape. But my Lego store, they normally like if it's half of it's hanging off or something, they'll just tape it and they don't 
really care. But this time, you guys can see they just let me like that. They're just like, oh yeah, that's fine. And I didn't want to mention it just in case, you know, I couldn't do that. But, um, yeah, you guys can see this was packaged really well. And pieces sticking to the tape. Sorry, this is taking so long, guys. And da, da, da. this is actually the one the Lego store employee did because they actually helped me, as I told you. Uh, they helped me, you know, put them in here, the bricks and stuff. So he did it really nice. They figured out like an algorithm. They said one of their other employees like actually knew that he wasn't there though, but he said they that he knew like a bunch of algorithms so you could fit the max into every cup. So. You guys can see uh, a bunch of these on the side, and I just put, you know, those kind of pieces on them. There's those. I'm going to take them all out. Here is the main killer. This one, again, was broken into two. Some of them aren't broken into two. You can see there's that. And then there's a second half. Um, bottom half, I'll get that out soon. Yeah, so you guys can see I have a ton of bricks in, but here is the bottom half, so that's nice. And then there's the other two. So yeah, there is all the bricks that were just in the sides, so that's a good amount. And then, you know, quite a few of them were filled with yellow bricks on them, these clear 1x2s, and then all oh, these white vents. So there is that. Um, it took me about 40 to 50, 40 minutes to an hour to destroy this. So you know, it takes a good amount of time, but it's worth it. So now I'll just show you guys quick updates on the base. Um, yeah, I finished. Um, you know, putting the red on there. There's that one. And so I just have to put uh, my red smooth pieces that are in the drawer on it. And then I'll build the uh, uh, roofs. I'll put them on. I'll put the battle crash stands on. And uh, yeah, so the guy at the store said that I should definitely bring my cups back in. Because he did the math and I told him how many cups I had. You guys can see there's all my cups. Crap load of them. Plus, there's six more, seven more over there. So he said I could have probably gotten a, three, a free large cup if I would have brought them in. But, oh well. So, um... Yeah, hope you guys like this did, and I'll see you later.